Hey everybody, it's Matt with OnX and I wanted to walk you through some of the new features and updates that we've done in Hunt Research Tools for 2025. So this is our application tool and it comes free with your Elite membership. So if you have an Elite membership, go ahead and jump in and start using this. And if you don't, you can upgrade and get this tool. Uh, all the links and information to log in will be probably in these video descriptions and other places in the app and web map that we'll show you. So I'm gonna jump in right now and talk a little bit about the updated filtering and walk you through that. So I'm gonna jump on the screen here and I'll walk you through on the computer. So when you get started, it'll kind of be blank like this and uh, we can go ahead and get started with the top level filtering. So I'll hit stop, start search. You see right here in the, in the red, but it's also just goes through these three options here. So you can start either way. It'll open up species. So for 2025, you can select one species at a time. Uh, <clears throat> it's January, so I'm gonna look at elk for Arizona. So we'll start by selecting elk. I'm excited to look at that. And then we'll choose states. These are the states currently offered, Alaska, Oregon, California, Nevada, Idaho, Montana, Wyoming, Utah, Colorado, Arizona, New Mexico, with Washington coming soon. So lots of states uh, to cover most of your Western needs. You can also do multi-state selections, which if you're looking at maybe comparing an elk hunt in Arizona, Utah, Montana, you can play around with showing the results for all three states at the same time, which can be useful as you start to narrow stuff down, look at season dates and stuff. Uh, <clears throat> for this one, let's just stay in Arizona. And weapons, I'm gonna do rifle. You can also do archery, handgun, muzzle loader, or shotgun, depending on where the state is. Go ahead and hit the search button. Okay, so now we see our results, and that was some of the top line uh, filtering that you can do. So you can go back and always edit these if you need to, just by clicking on the top here. We're good with elk. And you'll see that it lists, list your draw odds here. Uh, there's ways to sort it, which I'll go through later. Um, you can see we have 165 results here. Um, pretty cool stuff. So now I can go to more filters. Uh, and some states will have these and some won't, so it kind of depends on what they have that are active. But if you want to sort by male or female, bull or cow tags in Arizona, you can do that. So we'll stick with male. Uh, if you just want to hunt like during arch during the rut, so maybe there's some rifle hunts during the rut, or muzzleloader or archery is usually during the rut, you can select that and that'll help you filter the units down. Uh, some states have veteran only and youth only opportunities as well. So those are filters that you can play with. And <clears throat> so you can go ahead and hit apply. And you can see now we're down to 71 results for bull tags with rifle um, any season that we want. So that's a little bit about how to play with the filters. And I'm gonna go ahead and jump into the next feature. So our next feature is back in the filters, you can now search by your hunting dates. Um, and so all of our hunt research tools are based on the 2024 draw results, right? So the draw odds, uh, the tags given out last year, the success results. So it's all based on 2024 results. And so those have 2024 season dates. And so um, when we do our date filtering here, you can see that it'll show results from last year for plus or minus two days. That just counts for any variability in the weekends being off shifted by a couple of days uh, in 2025 versus 2024. So that way you can get all the results uh, for that season. So we can go ahead and come in here and I'm gonna say, um, you know, I've got a busy September, October in Montana. So I wanna hunt, uh, you know, maybe after Thanksgiving. So the 27th, you know, through the 31st of, 2025 and I, if I can go to Arizona that'd be awesome for elk so I can go ahead and hit filter for a late season and we now see that there are some late season rifle hunts here that I can go ahead and look at the odds for and apply for so one more way to narrow down the results by season here